This is pre-calculus, topic nine. We're working on this practice assessment and we're supposed to find the center, um, identify the type and find the eccentricity of this. And look at all this old nonsense. Let me get this out of the way. So uh, let's, let's rewrite it into that kind of graphing form and then we can go from there. So I'm gonna throw the x's together, four x squared plus 56 x plus nine y squared minus 18 y equals negative 169. Now I'm gonna complete the square. So um, divide a four out of here, factor out of four. Uh, 56 divided by four is uh, 14. Leave a little space so I can complete the square. Bring out a nine, y squared minus two y, still equal to negative 169. Great, now I'll do my square completing. Half of 14 is 7, 7 squared is 49, but this 49 is multiplied by a 4, so it's actually worth uh, 196. Boop. Uh, half of negative 2 is negative 1, square that is 1, so that's really a 9, so I'm also going to add a 9 over here. So, this left-hand side, x plus 7 squared y minus one squared, right? We've completed the square to get this to here, completed the square to get this to here. Add these all together, do, 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 it looks like 36. Divide out that 36 to get it equal to one. Uh, that's gonna leave me a nine in the denominator here. That's gonna leave me a four in the denominator here, just reducing that fraction, 936 equals one. Cool, so I know my center, I can read it right off of there, negative seven, one. I know my, uh, the type, this is an ellipse, and I know that because it's plus. And lastly, uh, my eccentricity, I'm gonna need C for that, it's C over A. So C squared is A squared minus B squared, and remember in the ellipse, it's the, the where the weight is, it's the heaviest one for the A. So C squared is nine, minus four, so that's a five. So C is root five. So um, my eccentricity must be the square root of five over three. Great, there it all is. Boom, ba-boom, ba-boom.